All right, everybody. Band of Wolf down here playing some more Baldur's Gate 2. We are playing a 100% completionist playthrough, trying to get all the achievements. Uh, so far, we've only got two, just these two right here. But we should start hitting a uh, a period where we get more more achievements because um, we're starting to hit into the meat of the game. Um, if I remember correctly, what we were going to do is do some side questing in in this area that we're in the copper coronet and um there were going to help corgan with his book and that's all i had planned uh for this we may not even get the well maybe i don't know 50 60 minutes um so we're going to talk to layton first Oh, I don't recall seeing your face in here before. Strangers aren't exactly welcome in these parts. Um, then let's not remain strangers. I'm Calvin. Mm, yes. Well, I am Leighton, proprietor of the Copper Cornet, if you will. Mm, welcome. Um. Now we want to ask him about this so that we can get into the back. Um. Coin is always welcome. You will find the copper cornet able to fulfill your needs, whether drink, rest, or other sorts of entertainment. Mm. Other sort of entertainments? What could you possibly be talking oh, about? One is always able to provide entertainment. Things like companionship, perhaps, or gambling on battles and other things. Um... What sort of other things? Very well. You look like you might appreciate such entertainments. There is more to my little place than meets the eye. Of course there is. Isn't there always? I don't, I don't, know, what, uh, I don't know what accent that was. Go over to the fellow by the door on the far wall and tell him I said to let you in. Talk to Frankie or perhaps Madame Nin if you wish to partake and enjoy. Mm. Oh, I would enjoy partaking, as he puts it. I've heard of the pleasures to be found here, but ye seem nay the type for it, Calvin being yellow and such. Your base appetites would be your destruction, dwarf. I am dismayed that Calvin has allowed such creatures you to walk, walk amongst us. Do not bait me, knight. I am nay the one that created such pleasures. I only be the one that takes what the gods have offered. Be dismayed on that, if you wish. So we got some sweet interjections here. Um, that's a good example. I've mentioned that before. Uh, so, okay, so, uh, investigate activities in the Copper Cornet's room. So, this sets us up to be able to actually go in the back and look around. Um, so, we talk to this guy, and he says that I can go in. Let's go in. What's in here? Okay, not there. Start looting. Rumar. So, there's a Rumar from that one woman. <laughs> Oh there, do you know if my shrew of a wife is out in the tavern still looking for me? Oh, you must be Rumar. Yeah, she's she's looking for you, all right. Really? Well, be a sport and don't mention my whereabouts to her. I'm rather tied up with my little pumpkin here. Isn't that right, pumpkin? <laughs> uh -huh. So now we're going to rat him out. You! Have you seen my husband? Yep. I know he's in here somewhere! <laughs> Go get him. You! Let me into these back rooms! This instant! Um, yes. He has it right away, ma'am. Alright. So she's got in. Okay. Rumor! Rumor! Hey, <laughs> darling. Don't you darling me! You will come home with me this very instant! Yes. Yeah. No, you can't have him. He's mine. One more word out of you, wench, and it'll be your last. Wench, wench, listen here, you old hoppy. Hoppy, that's it. G -g Girls, ladies, don't fight. Now let's see who wins. My money's on Tiana. 
Yeah. Tiana? My wife fought for me? You're damn right I did. Oh, darling, I'm sorry. Let, let's go home. All right, sweetums. So that was just a little diversion there. I wouldn't really quest. Uh, uh, let's dump these in here. All right, let's see what we got. Yar Yarin? Oh. Oh, it scared me. I thought that was a... Uh, Oh, th th that was this guy's man this is what are these i don't remember these but unfortunately we don't have anybody really that has good lore i've got 16 10 10 oh he's got 33 that's not bad maybe he'll be able to figure out what those are nope so just hang on to these i think there's some kind of healing gauntlets or something All right, let's hold off on talking to him. Sleeping dwarf. Uh, and I'm gonna <coughs> save here because I didn't save with that one. That that could have called the guards on me. All right. I am skilled. Yoshimo is willing. Okay. Give me some direction. It's done. Put these in here for a mage whenever we get one. And talk to Linus. I need a swig or some strong. Ah, oh me pardons. I thought you were that bloody ghost again. Again? You've been visited by a ghost before. Oh, I unfortunately. A uh, ghost has sometimes haunted me. Terrible, frightening thing it is. Why would a ghost be haunting you? Oh, uh, I, I, I don't know. I can't, can't say for sure. I, uh, excuse me, this doesn't be me private room. Could you please leave? All right. Next time, don't be bloody sneaking up on people when they're in the private rooms by mask. About to give me a heart attack, you did. I think he's related to a quest. Let's talk to Yarin. You should step carefully around the Shadow Thieves, my friend. Take it from whom who would know, eh? <laughs> what do you know about them? I know enough of them not to be crossing them. The Shadow Thieves have skilled assassins at their beck and call. With poisons that will stop your second breath, they will. Nay, if the Blood Scout feels you've done them wrong, you won't see your death coming. Deal with the Shadow Thieves only if you've an eye in the back of your head. Uh... I'm waiting. Couldn't remember how to grab everybody. Okay. Madam Nen. Are you interested in some brown stuff? Greetings, my lord. I am Madam Nen, and I'm here to ensure you are pleasantly accompanied. Are you interested in companionship, my lord? Oh, uh, no. Please excuse me. Let's look in here. Are you interested in some Okay. My bad. We're just looking for stuff to steal. You know, normal paladin stuff. That sound is really freaking me out. There's a subtle difference between the sound that you get when you open something that's not, uh, like, looked at. Um, it's not owned, like, like, like that sound. And the sound when you open something and it alerts the guard that's, like, echoier. Um, um, welcome to enjoy the entertainments. Okay. If by entertainment you mean steal everything. Okay. Um... If we go and look in here. Why, hello to you, dear customers. Welcome to the pit. You have animal fights back here, too. Better than that, we hear we have the very best in live entertainment. Actual combat between man and beast presented for your viewing pleasure. Combat between men, is it? Such a practice as... Oh, wait. Wait. Animan. Combat between men, is it? Such a practice is vile, Calvin. Surely we will not stand idly and allow such practices to continue. Witnesses the Copper Cornet's own gladiators fight for their lives in the pit. Um, is this illegal? All the legalities are such a technicality. The amusements here are for your enjoyment. 
let our staff worry about such matters as legality. Okay, so you're saying that there are fighters willing to risk their lives for the sake of entertainment. Willing or unwilling, it, it, it makes a little difference. The gladiators fight to amuse our clientele. I'm sure you'll agree they put on an excellent show. So they're slaves. Oh, it's such a harsh word, my lord. Here, we think of them as purchased employees and an excellent source of entertainment. Go on in and witness it yourself. Okay, this is uh, circular. Um, I'll be on my way then. Ha! <laughs> There's nothing wrong with a good and bloody fight. Your clan ring in their cries to the roof in your support. I've heard of the entertainment here, but ne'er seen it for myself. Okay... So these are the fighting pits. If I may have your attention once again, gentle folk of Ascatla, Leitenan is proud to provide for your amusement once again. Bring your attention to the pit as we see two combatants fighting for their very lives. I trust all bets have been placed. Very well. Begin. I will not fight. This is inhuman. How can you suffer this to continue? How can you? <laughs> you will fight because you are a slave and you have been told to fight. Refuse and be devoured for the amusement of our guests. They will force this man to fight? Justice is cried for here, Calvin. We cannot sit idly and allow this to continue. Oh, sh Jesus, it's a troll. Yeah, you screw, buddy. You don't got any way to kill that thing. Pretty sure the money's on the troll. Yep. Sure is. Man, very transparent slavery pit fighting ring they have here. I didn't really try that hard to get in here. So we're going to take a walk down to the back rooms. Peasant. Commoner. Okay, I think we want to go this way, actually. Declare yourself. What are you doing down here? This is a restricted area. Leave immediately or face the consequences. Um. Uh, what's going on? What's with all these cells? And they attack. Okay. Yeah. Okay, we need this guy. Give me some direction. Okay. Switch there. We got Corgan on that mage there. We need. Give me some direction. Everybody on that guy. I'm gonna draw this guy away so I can get some people in the room. I think we didn't get that. Okay. Okay, we got him. Cool, okay. Easy fight. Loot, 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 okay. And... Does this guy have anything? Nope. Okay, and... So we're working towards a, another achievement with this quest, I believe. I can't remember if it's just to complete it in here, because it kind of leads into a, a larger... A moment, friend. You are obviously not aligned with our captors. Might I know your name? My name is Calvin, and I'm certainly not aligned with Leighton and his men. Who are you? I am Hendak, a proud warrior from the north until my capture by slavers. I have been imprisoned longer than any of these men and survived, though only barely. <laughs> he could not be that great of a warrior if he were captured, I think. Wait, I'm gonna move more Scottish there. But I don't have a good Sc I don't have a good accent for any of these. I have done what I can to aid these other slaves and keep them living through the battles that Leighton and puts on to amuse his noble friends. I beg of you, please free us. I have never begged before, and yet I do it now so that I may wreak vengeance on Leighton and end his sick and twisted enterprise. Um, 
Yeah, we'll help. I truly hope that you will be able to, friend. The Beastmaster has the key to our cells. If you get the key from him, we'll be able to escape. We are going to free this warrior and his people. This is a task of great honor. We shall be great heroes for this. Heroes doing heroic things for all to see. May the gods aid your task. Would that I could help, but I shall have to be content with the hope that Leighton and will feel the cold swiftness of my blade. Okay. So, surprise, surprise. They have slaves. Okay. Uh, let's turn that off. Get that. You shall suffer my wrath. Oh, I don't want that. I want that dagger? Don't need that. Give me some direction. Oh, oh. I'm waiting. Yeah. Okay, we want to draw the direction. Beastmaster out of that room. So. I trust all of you. Hey, I don't recognize you. <coughs> Who are you? I'm here to free the gladiators. Fool, you'll never escape here alive. Come, Tabitha. Open the cages and aid your master. So, yeah. So, we draw them in here. I'm waiting. And then we can start wailing on them. I'll see you. Draw them into this choke. Uh, we can turn the AI back. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. That was not necessary. Let's do this quick and painful. Okay. okay. We're gonna move over here to draw him into the. Because if we stand here, he can see us through the. Like if we stand right here, he can see us down here through the fog war and shoot his bow. But if we go around the corner, he'll have to walk at least right here, and then we can. You require my counsel, yes? I'm waiting. Like that. And that way we don't have to move deeper into this choke point here with all. There's like monsters here, and there's here, and they're here, so we might draw them accidentally. Just draw them out a little bit at a time. But the Beastmaster is mainly the, the difficult part, so I'm gonna actually gonna speed this up a little bit. Is there nobody in here? Okay, that guy. Okay, there's one bear down. Scream. Scream for mercy. Got a minotaur down. And where's that other bear at? We need all the experience we can get. Okay. Wait, what? It... Enraged. Oh, okay. So I have to turn that off for you too. What does that even do? I'm not really. Uh. Okay. So. It... Okay. Okay. So we got the key. We got all this these here 
Do some organization here. Got a magic bow we can't figure out what to do with. On one hand, we don't have... Um, we do not have a mage, so... Classes that are mages typically are the best as far as lore, just to identify things right off the top of your, their heads. Um, like this. But... Um, so that's a downside to not having a mage in this party, but the positive thing is that in Athcatla, um, like at the beginning when we came out of the dungeon, Arenicus and uh, Emowyn got pulled away by the Cald Wizards for doing magic in the city. So if we had a wizard, we wouldn't be able to use it without getting fined. Now I don't know why they didn't find Emowyn and Arenicus, but... But probably because he like massacred half the city. But um, when we get a, a wizard, we'll have to um, we'll have to go and um, get a license so we can use the uh, so we can use the magic. Save the little boy. And let me here save the little girl. Okay, and then we get Leighton in. You have the key. You have it. Thank the gods. And thank you truly, my friend, for what you've done. We are free, my brothers. Go now and free the women. Hendak will strike his blade into the heart of our so-called owner, so that he shall never trouble you again. Go and savor your freedom. Praise be. We are free. Free at last. Thank you again, my friends. Now, to the task of killing that fiend Leighton. Assist me if you wish. Otherwise, stand and watch the vengeance of Hentak be fulfilled. Run! Run! The slaves have escaped! Oh, run for your lives! They'll kill us for certain! Okay. I'll test your metal with cold steel. Alright, now. I, <laughs> I don't know what it is that causes him to... That causes, uh, or just, not just him in general, but like in games like these, people to refer to themselves in third person. Um, I don't know anybody in real life that's ever actually done that, but uh, except ironically, I guess. Uh, more spells, more loot, more arrows. I think I'm gonna stop picking those up actually. Okay. Okay, we got more guards to fight. Time is, time is up you, my friend. Okay, I think we will stop picking the, the arrows up for right now. Just keep fighting our way through. Uh, okay. That's fine, I can take care of it. Okay. I'm waiting. Where is Hendak? Where yeah, buddy? Where you at? Usually he books it down here. Where'd he go? There he is. Took care of everybody. Let's go. I'll let you do the honors, finish him off. Come on. Come on. All right, here we go. Getting cold feet, huh? <laughs> okay. What? Hendak? You ignorant, barbaric slave. You're behind all of this chaos, aren't you? I'll take it out of your hide. Enough, fiend. You no longer own me. And I'll ensure that you no longer claim ownership over any other as well. I have survived your hellish fighting pit for years. You are the match for me. We shall see. All right. There. Easy. Finally over it. All the years of cruel and evil acts that you have committed for nothing more than coins in your pocket. Burn in the abyss, fiend! I owe you my thanks once again. 
As do all those you have freed. I intend to take this place as payment for my slavery to ensure it is never used as such again. I wish I did not have to ask, but there is one more task, task that needs doing. The slavers remain at large within Athkatla, hidden at their base here in the slums. There are many children yet that they retain as slaves. I would ask of you to rid the city of this infestation once and for all. Um, definitely, definitely. I knew you would not let me down. The compound is not far from here. A dry docked boat just across the way to the east side of the slums. It may be risky to approach openly. There was talk of a secret passage to the sewer connecting the coronet to the slaver base, but I do not know where it might be. I know nothing of the defenses of the place inside, however. My stay there was brief and very long ago. More children kept as slaves! Boo is outraged by the evil that leaps about the city like a hot-footed weasel. We must save the children, Calvin, we must. Ah, a chance to strike at the heart of slavery here in Athkatla. Think of it, Calvin. You could make a difference if you wish, at least for a while. Take on the slavers themselves. On their home ground? I don't know. Do it if you must, Calvin. But don't think it will be easy. Everybody's got an opinion. Okay, so take his stuff. He's got some good money. I think I'm just going to get that scroll case and uh, hang on to it with my main character. So that I don't have to keep switching between. Like that. Okay. Okay. I will always be grateful for your assistance. Bernard, okay. I got some cheap beer for ya. Selling all my junk. What does he have? Blade of Ro Roses. It's a longsword, too. But it's like all my money. That would be really good for my paladin. As like the... Workhorse weapon. Mm, these would be good probably for... Uh, um, Anaman. So he's got some pretty cool stuff, honestly. Okay. Yeah, he's got some pretty cool stuff. Okay, so I thought there was an achievement to just um, get the get the uh, ownership of the copper cornet over to Hendak. Choices. Okay, side quests. Put Hendak in charge of in charge of the copper cornet. Maybe I have to do the, um, kill the slavers. Um, because like I said, this leads into another quest. Um, it leads into another quest, like, you know, like we just gave us, uh, free Hindak and the slaves. Okay, yeah. So the quest actually isn't complete, so we'll continue doing that. Okay... Go this way. Let's see what's in here. Give me okay. So this is the back way into it through the sewers. Fear is for those of no confidence. Very well. I'm waiting. Hey You cast bless, eh? Hey? Anima, what do you got? Can't let him do that to us. You ain't got no offensive Fire spells, huh? Works. I don't think Jahira has really any anything offensive. I guess we'll do that and then just wail on him. But we do have this. So we'll... I'm trying to get to where I can mow him down. Here we go. It's like a chainsaw. <laughs> I 
I don't know why freaking Corgan walked all the way away from him, but... Um... A bunch of stuff. Okay, now we can put those there. He can actually use this, and I think he can use the. Uh, nope. Don't know what that is. Protection from cold. I don't know why the non magey types can use those, but we'll go ahead and run with it. Okay, so as far as I remember, we have to get through the the sewers here and. I'm pretty sure there's exits from the sewers into, like, the town or something. So this is kind of like a crossroads where this quest is overlapping with just, um, with, like, a common area. Because I think there's other, like, events or quests or things to do. There's something in there. Hmm. Does that do that? Does that remove the the slow? No, it sure don't. I'm gonna be honest with you, I'm not really an expert with the spell interactions, especially re regarding uh, the spell interactions regarding like dispel magic and breach and those types of things. So maybe I'll look into that right after I kill this thing. So we got slow on, which kind of sucks. Okay, let me read that because I know it. I, I know I use breach um, for most of like. A counter offensive like if an enemy mage has some kind of spell on him I use breach and then I can I use dispel but I and then I usually use dispel to take care of um, any things that are on my dudes uh, effects giving from spells potions a certain magic it does not affect magic turning the chance of the spell succeeds is determined by the level that, yeah I remember reading about this recently on reddit so the base chance is 50% and then for every level that the caster is above the original caster. So he probably would have had a higher chance. Because of the way that I've been playing this. He's level 10. I don't know if it's caster level or whatever. So he probably had a good chance to dispel that. He just um, failed. Um, we got... Do I have some kind of like remove... No. Oh, wait. No, I don't think that works. I don't think that does anything. No, it's just poison. This should wear off the, um... The disease. But the slow is going to be kind of annoying. And we do want to do that, because we get something from it. It's like a hand. This is a desiccated hand that you found in the sewers. Despite the moisture, the flesh is, has not rotted away. I honestly don't remember what that's for. Like I said, that I, I'm pretty sure that's related to something taking place in this sewer that's not related to the slaves that we're working working towards. Uh, I kind of want to rest just to get rid of the the slow and the uh, disease. It's going to be super annoying just to deal with. There we go. Okay. Two skeletons lie entwined in each other's arms in an internal embrace. One of the skeletons is slightly smaller than the other. On its bony finger, there's a golden ring. You can move it if you wish. I'll yep. It. The Lover's Ring. This is a ring you've obtained from two entwined skeletons. It was on the finger of the Get woman's remains. Okay. I think... Oh, yeah. So... Gotta switch. I need to get Animan a uh, magical weapon. Um, because I've got everybody else at least some option. 
but he doesn't. He's new. Swords, not I words. Do you need? Yes. Point the sword. Yes. I am ready. What is it? All right. Uh, let's go in here. Okay. Now they're gonna do a lot of mind stuff. I hear you well enough. Shh, is there anything that I have? That's uh, against the mind stuff. I don't think so. You I think we're just gonna brunt force, hope that they make their saves. Like I said, I'm not an expert. I have finished the first game on, uh, uh, like Legacy of Ball Mode, but that doesn't mean I know the game inside and out at all. Let's see what your guts be looking like. There's more than one way to skin a cat in this game, and Legacy of Ball Mode for the first game was actually a lot less uh, mentally taxing than I thought. It was actually kind of just bash your head against the wall uh, and keep at it until you uh, until you succeed. Uh, I thought there was something else like what we've been finding in here, like a item or something. Actually, I'm going to give him these. Use that, and we'll keep moving. I thought there would be an item in here that's unique, like those two. Like, those are obviously, like, quest-ish items for this area. I think that you use those. There's, like, a, a magical two-handed sword in here that's really interesting. And I think you use those to get the item. There's traps in here somewhere, like in one of these hallways. Okay. You're right behind me, right? I'm waiting. Uh, yeah, the I think you get Lil Arker in this sewer somewhere. Give me some direction. I'm pretty sure there's a trap on that door that's being used as a uh, as a bridge across. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Nah, there's gonna be monsters. I think there's um, kobolds or some crap down here. Give me some directions. So I'm actually going to. I'll do as you tell. Only if there be a good amount of coins of it. I'm waiting. I'm there. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's kobolds. Yeah. Uh, okay. What do you want, Crown? A best be paid well. Do I want to just give me some direction? I'm waiting. I've killed. I shall go point the. I think these uh, kobolds automatically attack you. What is it? Be quick with it. I, I'll do as you wish. Now. Hmm. Do I just force it? I'm pretty sure, because I'm pretty sure this um, shaman has a a special, a um, like an item. You go for the eyes. Whoa, buddy! Corgan, you need to stop. Uh, Berserking. That's. I don't want you to do that. He shouldn't be berserking because I set his uh, script to um to just the auto attacks. That's what I do for most of them. Okay, that is something. And this is, I think, just a magic short sword. Yeah. <gasps> So, I guess we'll just give it to him to sell. That we do, definitely want to sell. And then this is the uh, other item I was mentioning, the co shaman staff. 
This is a staff of good berries that belong to the Cobalt Shaman in the sewers below the slums. Um, nobody can use that, so... I'm waiting. And we got some carrion crawlers. These can uh, stun lock you. It's not great. They have some kind of paralyzation in their bite, but he never got it off. And see a barrel over here. I think there's one more item of some kind, and we like put them in pipes or something. <laughs> oh, what do you need? I think there's traps in right there in front of the grate. Maybe. Maybe here? Yeah. Yeah, there was. Nothing dangerous, I Okay. That freaks me out when it does that. Give me some direction. I hope that it's worth it. Oh yeah, I, I remember how you get to the last one. So you gotta talk to this dude. <clears throat> what is it? Yes. You have come for the blade, I suppose. It is as we have always expected, my friend. He glances to the creature beside him. Too long in this pit. Too long. What friend? Who are you speaking to? The This beast that you see, he is a monster to you, but he, but to me he is a friend. Would you like to kiss him? He loves affection. He loves to taste the flesh of the unwary. It is his one weakness. It has been his gift to me for these long years. This is your friend. My one true companion, Topsider. I see. Tell me of this blade that you spoke of earlier. The gleam in your eye. It belies your greed, your passion. I found this blade, child. It is hidden most insidiously. A cruel jest has been played upon us all. My friend here knows this. Where can I find it? The one has left clues for you. Have you not found the clues? Where the topside dra filth drains, there are the clues. Return to me ere you follow the one's past, for as there is much you must learn. Uh, who is the one? You have met him already, child. Perhaps soon you will know him well. Find the clues the one has left. There's danger in what you must undertake. Okay, I shall look for these clues in return. Where the topside filth drains, there are the clues. Return to me. Ere you follow the one's past further, there's much that you need to learn. Enough! If there be treasure to be had, you shall place it in our hand with none of this nonsense and riddles. Lest my axe find your tongue. It will kill me if you must, impatient ones. But it shall place the blade in thy greedy hands no faster. Okay, so there's a quest. Solve the puzzle, the riddle in the sewers. Man named Qualo has mentioned something out of a blade and clues being hidden in the sewer. I'm going to seek out these clues elsewhere. In the sewer, presumably where the water drains from above. Okay, I think I'm going to head this way and just watch for traps. Because I... I Got a sixth sense that there's traps around here. Oh, hello. Yeah. Be quick Give with me it. some direction. I'm waiting. All right. Now we don't have any. We don't have any cool potions or spells like the last one, so we're just gonna have to mop these guys up one by one. That what is that? A held. Hmm. Oh, he ran too. I'm pretty sure this is the way to go to the slavers. Be quick with it. I'll do as you can. Only if there be a good amount of coin. Um, and if you notice, there were two that run down that hallway, and, um, one of them disappeared. He actually went into the room. 
so we'll have to fight him when we go up there. 